Okay, great. So let's continue our series of Laplace transform, and today we're gonna talk about Laplace transform. constant. So what is the Laplace transform of this? Integral from 0 to infinity, the definition of Laplace, minus st, f of t, dt, equal to integral. What are you going to do? Just replace the function you want Laplace uh, for here. So we can have e to the power of 80 dt. Very well. From 0 to infinity. When you multiply this, you just, if you have e to the power of t, multiply pi e to the power of t, you have e, then you, you add these, right? So 2t. This is the rule, okay, of multiplication. If you have the same power, of e, or even if you have 3t, this is going to be 4, 4t, okay? So you're going to have 4 e to the power of 4t, and so on. So in this function, you have this. If we, if we take minus as a common factor, we will get the following, s minus a and then multiply by t. If we just put the minus back you'll get the same function. This is very important. Okay, very well. We have not integrated yet. To integrate the function we have taken the previous lessons that if you have e to the power of anything say of t, if you want to integrate this then you're going to multiply by the derivative of the power with respect to the t, and then you're going to divide it. So the integration of exponential is the same, but this is just what we add to the exponential. The same idea, if you want to integrate this term, you're going to multiply by minus s, okay, s minus a, and then you're going to divide the same term over s minus a. Okay? Very well. And the integration of exponential is the same. So, minus 1 over s minus a. And the integration of this is the same. So, e to the power of minus s minus a. And then you're going to put the limit of integration from 0 to infinity. And we have we know that if you put the a right there, okay, if we replace the uh, a with infinity, okay, we're going to have 0. Okay, so this is equal to minus 1 over s minus a. So by 0, minus. If you put 0, replace 0, multiply, I think this is t, there's, sorry, there is t right there, okay? So if we, if we replace t by infinity, this term, the whole term, will be minus infinity. So anything that over, we, we know this. So e to the minus infinity is actually equal to 1 over e to the power of infinity, which is equal to 1 over infinity which equals to 0. So whole, all, whole this term will be 0. Okay? So very well. So if you if you plug in infinity, whole term will be 0. And if you put 0, whole term will be 1. So you have 1 over s minus a. Okay? Very well. So the integration of exponential to the constant of, a, of t will be s minus a and we call minus a is shift so we call it shift shift by by a okay 
Very well. Thank you for watching this video. See you in the next video.